everybody, my name is Becky and I welcome you to my muscle function video series. Today I want to go over the flexor digitorium longus muscle. I'll go over its location which includes the origin and insertion, following that with its functions, and then finally providing you an exercise or two so you know how to strengthen this muscle. So let's get started with the location so we know where we're talking about and then we'll build on from there. The flexor digitorium longus muscles originated or started from the middle third of the posterior surface of your tibia and then runs down along the back side of the lower leg pretty much where the calf goes down and to the medial part of your foot under the arch and inserting onto the distal phalanxes of the lesser four toes so basically every toe but your big toe so just so you know where you're talking where I'm talking about here, I'm going to go ahead and show you, I'm going to zoom in on my leg and show you exactly what I'm talking about. So as you can see here, here's my cat, okay? So the origin of the flexor digitorium longus muscle is on the middle third of the posterior surface of your tibia, which is right about in here, okay? And then this muscle runs down along the back side of the leg, okay? So it runs down along the back side of the leg, comes around to the side of your foot, and comes around the arch. So it's very important in arch support. And then runs down along the bottom of your foot and connects to the distal phalanxes of your lesser four toes. So the smaller four toes on the last knuckle before the toenail is where this muscle inserts or connects to. Okay, so now that you know exactly what I'm talking about on on a body, I'm going to go ahead and show you an illustration so you know what this muscle looks like. So now that you know where the starting point and the ending point is for the flexor digitorium longus muscle, I can now move on to the functions of this muscle. So this muscle has three different functions. The first function is toe flexion. So toe flexion would basically be curling your toes into the carpet or into the ground. Okay. The second function is foot inversion, which is moving, putting the bottom side of your foot up towards the middle. So if you have both of your feet flat on the floor, and you roll both of them so you can see the bottoms like this that is foot inversion and then the third and final function of this muscle is plantar flexion so if your foot is flat on the ground and you go to do a calf raise or lift your body up to stand on your the ball of your foot this muscle also does that so now that we know the location and the functions of the muscle, now I can move on to exercise examples. So I'm going to show a couple clips and kind of talk through those clips so you know what I'm doing. And then um, that will wrap things up for this video. So stay tuned. Here's the exercise clips. So for the first exercise I have for you guys, um, what you could do is you will need to be barefoot, obviously. Uh, you will curl your toes into the floor, so toe flexion. And you will do inversion of the feet. And then you're going to try to walk. Okay. Now, obviously, it's going to feel awkward and you may not be able to do a lot. But this, mu this will strengthen this muscle. Okay. I actually feel it up through the bottom. And then I can really feel it back in here. So that is example one. Now let's move on to example two. Okay. So for the second example that I can show you here is pretty much you're going to be doing toe curls. So what you'll want is like a washcloth, a towel, maybe a light t-shirt, nothing too heavy that you can actually pull along with the toes. 
So what you're going to be doing is you're just going to be grabbing a hold and pulling the shirt or the towel along the ground. Okay. Now this one's a little difficult because it seems to want to stick to the ground. Okay. So if I were to take this, let's lay it out a little bit better. Okay. Let me move closer. And you can do this standing or sitting, whichever you prefer. Okay, there we go. And all you're going to do is toe curls. Okay, everybody, that is all I have for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you found value in it or uh, you found something out that was new or found it helpful, hit the like button. That helps other people see the video. Um, if you know a friend maybe that needs the information, pass on with a share. Share the link. Um, you can always get the link below. Um, if you have any comments or questions, please feel free to post them in the comments box or you can always get in touch with me. I will post my information below in the information box. But otherwise, I will see you all next week. Have a great week and I hope you all had a great Christmas. I know I did. So I will see you guys all next week.